Hello everyone, for today's video, we're going to be just kind of walking around and checking out some uh, old hotels that are fixing to no longer be here. Uh, these are soon to be demolished. The first one is the Seahawk, and then the one beside it is the Seahorn. And I think there are three buildings total that are part of this. This one here has got some murals that are painted down there towards the end. We'll go and take a look at this. I've never walked up close to these before. Uh, the murals kind of caught my attention whenever I pulled in here and parked. So I'm just going to walk around and kind of check it out. So the recording of this video is Friday, March 18th, 2022. And it's currently about 6.45 p.m. And it's about 73 degrees here in downtown Myrtle Beach. So they've already got some demo equipment in here, as you can see. So maybe they're going to start with this one. I think the uh, owner's idea from what I read online is to, he wants to remove these old buildings and build something new. I think there will be uh, new hotels that go up. I'm not exactly sure what the exact plans are. If I find something online for that, I'll include a link in the description for that. We're going to head out on the beach. Let's see if we can get a view from there. So this is the pool here. That it's obviously turned colors. They started ripping carpet and things out. We got them on the balconies there. It's kind of a common sight when something like this happens. Looks like they've thrown one table in the pool there. Probably launched it off one of the balconies, I bet. So this is a shot from the beach. So it appears from the beach that there are three separate buildings, but really there's just two, I think. Because I believe this one here and this one are attached to each other. I think I remember seeing that from the front side. And then this uh, two-story one here is uh, separate from that one. So this is a Seahawk here. And then the Seahorn there. Seahorn is the one we saw where the uh, crane was already sitting up front. So I'm guessing maybe it'll go first. So we're going to go check out those murals. So I have no idea what this scene is supposed to be. It's got some waterfalls on it, cliffs. It's pretty fascinating to look at. But this is a real scene. It's got to be from another country. And there's a giant peace sign down here at the end, too. Looks like someone's had some lunch here, too. The pool has plenty of water in it, but I don't think you'd want to jump in that. Probably not a good idea. This is the other mural. 
a lighthouse on it. Some birds, the palm trees. It's a nice beach scene. And pretty nice looking artwork. Not much longer though. See where someone has ripped down a conduit here for a light fixture. You kind of see some of these rooms have already been wiped out. Probably tried to salvage certain things that they could. Also another mural here in the hallway. A little more colorful than the other two. So I think that's going to do it for this one. I uh, just happened to be passing through on a long weekend trip. And I thought I'd share a location that is here now but will not be here much longer. Uh, there's a couple other locations uh, further uptown that we may check out. Uh, keep an eye out for those on the channel in the future. But that's going to do it for this one. Uh, if you like this video, uh, please give it a thumbs up. I greatly appreciate it if you would, and please consider subscribing if you have it. Those two things will not cost you anything. As always, thanks for watching.